When we started Coffee Stain, I think the dream was just to make games. To be able to make games and uh, get some sort of a paycheck by the end of the month. That seemed really, really cool to, uh, to just kind of see, can we do this? We just kept rolling, rolling from there. I would say that the foundation of the game industry here in Skövde started in 2002 when the University of Skövde decided to combine their educations or their specialized areas in IT and in media aesthetic and narration into the, the, the game development programs. And uh, the Science Park stepped up and adapted their incubation program to accommodate for the specific needs of the game industry as well. A lot of us have studied together and we have gotten to learn about game development and just starting these companies together. I think there's a lot of support to get from your neighbor. You can, as a developer anywhere in the world, attract a global audience and that is of course a big opportunity but it's also a challenge how to manage this, especially as a startup company where you have limited resources. What do you prioritize? How do you do it? Because there was this whole surrounding environment with the university and the science park and uh, the push to, to create companies, uh, that, that was what created us. This wouldn't have happened without everything that's, that's here in Skövde. We really went from nothing to, to a lot. <laughs> it has been super exciting. It wasn't something that I expected. And I think that's one of the things that I really like about this industry. Anything could happen. I think that the game ecosystem in Kvevde thrives because of collaboration. Cross borders, cross discipline, industry, academia, the municipality. And this has given opportunities for academia to re do research on industry, for the municipality to, to attract talent to the region, for investors to meet new and successful companies. You have a future as a game developer in Kvevde.